Hello and welcome to the Drowned. Oh boy. I said in my uh, playthrough of Soma that there's something pretty uh, scary. Whoa. Whoa. Stop munching on my. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> and then that, that's it. I'm that what the fuck? Okay, let me deal with this guy first and then I'll talk about what I was gonna talk about. <laughs> what a way to stop. Okay. Guess we gotta watch out for whatever the fuck these things are. Okay, I'm am I dead again? No. Yes. <laughs> okay, so apparently aiming is a bit difficult. There is no like zoom in or anything or, or crosshair, I just have to <laughs> pull the trigger and hope. Hey kids. Can't get rid of him. I'll scare him off. Seems to have done the trick. Oh. Nope, there's another one. Why can't I still... Whoa, am I still alive? Why can't I... Oh, I'm still alive. I'm bouncing on. Fuck you guys. Wait, is this where I started? I think this is where I started. God damn it. Well, these guys seem to be mollified. <laughs> See, little lads. Let's continue bouncing on until we reach the surface. So, yeah, that's what I was going to say before. I got. Whoa, 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 whoa! Whoa, 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 where am I? Okay. Don't panic. Don't panic. I'm panicking. What the fuck is going on? Okay, I guess this is the wrong way. <laughs> I never got to reach the surface at this rate. Yep, stay there. Get it straight bouncing down this way. Okay. So what I was trying to say, they only detect motion. Thanks, that would have been nice to know earlier. <laughs> Swim away, please. Okay, so what I was trying to say earlier... Was <laughs> that during my playthrough of Soma? I think I talked a lot about how what the fuck is up with this lighting? With how like the deep parts of the ocean is the scariest, like one of the scariest places to me because it's so alien in a way to anything you'll see on land, which is obviously where we spend 99.9 .9 recurring time. Um, and so you just don't know what you're going to be up against with next. And, like, humans are so, pardon the possible pun, out of their depth in the ocean that, uh, clip through that good, that you, you just feel like a complete outsider in an alien world, and that, that's scary. And so many things can go wrong, and you can die so many horrible deaths. What are you doing? You're just having a nice little time licking at that illuminated pole. Doesn't seem too fussed with me at the moment. So yeah, you just have fun. And there's like a, a sense of like, I guess, vulnerability that comes with entering into something else's world. But as I say, humans aren't meant really to be underwater. We're not designed for it. We have to wear special shit and do special things to actually just stay alive, let alone defend ourselves. So when you come into a world like this, you feel very small. And the giant amount of water above you probably doesn't help. By the way, this is not <laughs> this is not me jumping along. That's that's your basic movement. You bounce. You're a bouncy boy. Okay. 
okay. So then this is what makes me like paranoid because I'm not used to like looking up for things <laughs> on land. I don't know if you guys have ever been on land, but the only thing above you tends to be birds and planes. And the only time you ever need to look up for something that might kill you is uh, in a very, very bad situation indeed. Um, in the ocean, you got, yeah, more places to worry about. Uh, I don't know what these things are supposed to be, but they got very sharp mouths on them. Why, why, why does my screen keep going black? Is the pressure finally getting to me? Oh, oh, maybe not that way. Maybe, maybe not. Aha. <laughs> Hello, friend. Nice day for a swim. I'm going to bounce off of this wave, if you don't mind. Just having a nice bouncy time of it. Ooh, what the hell's that? It's an odd time. Okay. I think we found the mama. Hey, big mama. How you doing, girl? Whoa. The tail is scything through absolutely everything. You tell your baby to get the fuck out of the way. Because he's right where I want to be right now. Okay, can I gently go down here? Go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. Try a gentle drop. This isn't gentle, this is gonna be tough. Oh. Okay. Okay, water broke my fall. <laughs> now it's harder to see. Okay, I actually kinda of like the lighting down here. It's quite nice. And for as much as I keep clipping through and bouncing around like on a pogo stick, it's quite a nice atmosphere to it. I find myself being genuinely tensed up right now. It's the Mark of an excellent setting. All we need is a handful of good executions to really set it off. Okay, maybe not that. You know what I mean. Can I bounce around this way? I guess we need to head for that tower. Oh boy. I'm in a bit of a lag situation. Oh god. Doesn't like something around here. I'm gonna bounce up. But that might have been a bad move. Those big mamas are coming right overhead. Hey big mama. get a good look at whatever the hell you are. I'm hoping these things are checkpoints. Whoa. Whoa there, big mama. There's no need to go in immediate 90 degrees and clip into the wall. It's just unnecessary. Come on, get up. Ugh. Gotta find another way up, I guess. Ooh, there we go. Hopefully we didn't attract too much attention. Big Mama don't care. Damn it, you guys. There are three of them. Oh, no, fucking god damn it. Just go fuck up. Whoa. Uh. Hey, dude. I think I went a bit of a wrong way. 
<laughs> Maybe I can get back to where I was. There we go. Yep, you clear off. That's a good boy. Oh, they're bouncing. Does not help the platforming. Have you aggroed or are you just spazzing out? <laughs> the eternal question of underwater life. Aggro or spazzing out? Big Mama coming on in. Okay. <laughs> Managed to land that shot, so. How's Big Mama doing? Okay, she's on the move. There's a couple here we have to tango with. Hopefully we can just scooch forward a bit. Nice and easy. You guys just don't want to clear off, do you? Find you. Did I get him? Don't know. Oh, big mama's coming. I don't know what this place is, but we're heading there. <laughs> I think I left them behind. They're staying with Big Mama. Just perfectly fine with me. Is any of this going to help me get to this? Oh, okay. That's definitely linking up to the surface. I'm guessing this is going to help me... Uh, Trottle on home. <laughs> what year is this set in, by the way? When do they have weird, glowy space guns underwater? Because I want in on that shit. I want a time frame on that shit. Okay. Hello, I've come to be rescued. If you could, uh,. Just rescue me real quick. Oh god, is that your rescue? Okay, you're blinding me with your credits. Okay, <laughs> so yeah, that was Drowned. Interesting little game. I like underwater horror games. That one was well, it was very basic. Um, but I just I chose it because I like the underwater setting. And it kind of proved that it works. It is a really good setting for a horror game. Uh, even when it says rough around the edges of this, but I think it was made in the jam, so it was like 48 hours to make a game or something, so you I mean, you can't expect like <laughs> supremely polished games. You expect a good idea that's just played out, and it was a good idea that was just played out, so well done to them. 
Uh, if you want to give Drown a go for yourself and shoot Big Mama with his gun, I'll put a link down in the description for you. Uh, and as always, thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you like my content, please do check out my other videos. And if you do, I shall see you there. Goodbye. Boom.